I'll climb. Wow. That had to be 60 to 65 feet. Mason from deep. Oh, oh he connects. Wow. I kind of thought maybe the editors were showing us the difference between a perfect drive and a terrible drive getting the same score. But in the end, Mason gets the score that he deserved with such a great drive. It's not bad, that's for sure. He's got he's got opportunity to go for the birdie here. Ooh, and I like how he takes that left side, Whoa. uses the ceiling, and look at this slow drift. Slow drifter. down. Oh, wow. what a shot, Corey. Ew. Oh, Let's that see that every again. Bit of this. Yeah, that was fantastic. Look at the sustained turn. And it splits wow. that. Wow. Very difficult to split that stagger tree gap coming at that angle. This has enough length, which I'm sure it yeah. does. Oh, yeah. wow. <laughs> Should be perfect. Another look at the drive of Matt Orham. Nice height, nice width. Height allows it to pull all the way back, and the skip nearly gets a piece of the basket. This is not one that you're circling on the scorecard. I have to get that. That's better height from Niklas. Good angle as well. Oh, wow. That is a thing of beauty. Mm. Some ant just sits down. Like, that, this, hill, this basket is on a pretty steep hill. That's the best shot we've seen on this hole. To control it in like that, the drift, and now the, just the gentle fade into the front of the hill, almost no energy left. You could hardly do it better. And that's a master class in that shot right there. Niklas, beautiful. Obviously, hindsight, easy to say. Oh, wow. what a par save. Come on, Anthony. That is an Second amazing shot par. pitch out. Amazing par. That is what he has really improved on this season. His putting has been I mean, phenomenal. look at that Annie, too. Yeah. Just to extend it a mm -hmm. little bit more. That was great. Does he? Does he? No way. What a finish. Wow, 80 footer. This is a strange spot for the drive to be. Go in. Go in. Mason, oh, no. Oh, no. No, no, no. Do your job. That was awful. So smooth, so slow. Joey. No way. What? And it sticks. <laughs> what what a birdie. <laughs> no way. Oh my, uh, you know what? I did fail to mention at the beginning of the broadcast that I did not watch this. I didn't watch this live and I don't know. Well, okay, I, I can't lie. I know who wins, but that was an accident. I don't know how they won. Wow. What a shot. That was awesome. I certainly didn't know that Joe just threw one in from the fairway. Incredible. Oh, heart. Big time. On the strike. And that gives you such a different set of options. Wow. Look at the width on this thing. And then hysering back in the middle into the pocket. So important to not walk to 18, absolutely yeah. needing birdie. That is, a, that is a very scary hold to have to get the birdie. You're absolutely right, Nate. At 305 feet. Hurry. Oh. Man, that is nice. Oh, oh wow. come on, Goodness. Andrew. That, that, Whoa. Spe speaking from experience, like trying to throw that little tight flex line, there's not a lot of room in there. He gets this over just perfectly, knows the disc. And wow. doink, wow, just a couple inches from ringing that up. 
really want to keep it low and left. Niklas. Nice shot here. Niklas with the forehand driver. Oh! oh in ace. Corner pocket. Right side. <laughs> yeah, look at these. Look at the reaction. Well, High you five, remember, okay. he just missed a Double 13 bogey. Fo footer for, for bogey there. So Even we'll... par between 9 and 10 is pretty good, folks. Wow. Watch this catch, though, right in the pocket. Click. Wow. Last person on the day to throw the hole and gets the ace. That's kind of cool.